What's up YouTube? So I currently read a cool thing about IBM. So IBM is a company that uh, do cool computers and cool things like this. For example, they made this cool uh, deep blue machine that could beat, I think it was Gary Kasparov in chess, either 1996 or 1997. So they made that supercomputer that could basically play games better than humans. I also think they did this uh, Jeopardy machine that could uh, win in Jeopardy. And now they made a new supercomputer, an AI artificial intelligence machine computer that can argue and debate against humans. It's a computer that can argue and it can make jokes also to humans. And uh, it debated against some professional humans and um, the project is called Project Debate. So it won an argument or it, it won a debate against, against a human by the, 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 the watchers that uh, voted. They said that the computer was sort of bad. I'm not sure if they didn't know it was a computer. I don't think so. But they, they sort of think that one was uh, better at making arguments. So this is very cool. This is how it uh, looks. Wait a sec. So that's how it looks, right? So that is the computer. That's the human, okay? This is the IBM computer. Here you can argue with the, the computer. So that is pretty, pretty awesome. And it just shows where the future is going. That it's probably not gonna be humans. Humans are still ahead, just as humans in games, humans are still usually better than machines, even though human or robots are sort of getting closer to be better than, than humans in games. And eventually probably they're gonna be able to argue better because humans are still a little bit better here to argue stuff, right? But the more we're gonna feed these computers, the more they're gonna be better. Then there are some rumors about the robot uh, apocalypse that they're gonna take over human humans. I don't think so. I mean, humans, I don't think we really have to worry that much. It's on, the, the only the, the humans that have to worry is the people that are stuck in their mind, that think their mind is life but um, it's not really. The things that makes humans valuable is that we can be conscious of doing things. For example, a donkey or an ape or a monkey or a horse, they can live life, but they're not really conscious of what they're doing. So the thing that makes humans valuable is our consciousness. Robots, they probably, or and the super AI computers from IBM, they probably never really gonna have um, consciousness right but they can do everything else they can do the work because if every, every single work that we're doing if it's just ones and zeros the, the computers can do it for us and we can focus on doing whatever it is that we rather spend time doing so it's going to be interesting to see how this is going to go ahead or how it's going to work in the future so they are right now working on natural language processing at uh, refining it until it, it turns into perfection. The interesting thing is that we humans are living more life now in the cloud. So most of our life in the future is probably going to be voice assistants. We're going to have voice assistants. We're going to have robots in our home. We can argue with them. We can talk to them. We can discuss to them. And we're going to have this voice that speaks, uh, talk, uh, talks uh, to us. We have this with the Amazon's uh, Echo product at the moment. But it's just going to be developed more and more and more. And uh, we're going to have nice assistance, basically, which is very, very cool. So, yeah, quick little video talking about are you excited? You probably are very excited about it. Because the future discussions are probably not going to be two humans, but it's going to be a, ro a robot computer over there and a human there. Eventually, we're probably just going to have um, uh, two computers arguing against each other. And maybe we're going to have a robot audience as well, robot computers in the audience. Uh, these days when we, are, we turn on the TV, we see people argue and stuff like that. They usually, we usually never get anywhere when humans argue about stuff because we use emotions. Uh, so we are emotional creatures, which is, uh, we're not logical creatures, right? Some people think we're logical creatures, we're not. But the, the robots will be able to look at things from a more... Uh, clear logical perspective right without using their emotions which is going to be a very exciting and very cool future 
So yeah, I wanted to talk a little bit about that because I think it's kind of cool. So you have AI and the computers and everything is taking over more and more and more. Yeah, have an awesome day, YouTube. Bye-bye.